Okay, here's the one we're headed for now. Let's just get down and have a look. Um, all right, well, we land there. Initiating landing. Just trying to tell how dark it is. I can now see what time it is. Looks like it's coming up in the morning already, which would be nice. Let's have a look. Get out and have a look. Um, no, it's 11 o'clock at night, apparently. Oh, so it's not going to get much darker than this. So we'll try and take the camera view at the moment. Okay, as it's not going to get very dark. We should have a quick look. Um, there's a fair few lights, but as I say, it's not going to get dark enough to really look. And it looks like it's getting morning already, so 11 o'clock at night. Oh well, let's wait for the rest of the morning. All right, so night time did not last very long at all. It's about half past one now. <laughs> it's already got light. Oh, I don't know. Right, uh, so what we got here, the landing pad has got six landers on it. On each one, as far as I can tell. So two points with six landing spots. All smacked on top of one another. That should get nice and cosy when you all land. All right, let's get down to one side of the building. Let's go underneath this massive head. And have a look at the, uh, <laughs> looks like cucumbers. <laughs> all right, no cucumbers. Uh, we got a shouty geck selling snot bubbles, postules, and geck statues. Uh, I guess he's biased. Right, on we go. Nice big portal in the middle and uh, what are they called? Moon pools? And probably stones. Looks like it. Nice arrangement. As you can always count on one thing from Mr. Dabs. He loves his decoration. Look at them. Look at them. Uh, we'll get lost in a minute. Just keep to the idea. So here we have another set of uh, circular patterns. I'd rather it's just not drawn or whether it's supposed to be like that. Okay, well, flowers. This is... No, I've no idea what that... Oh, wait a minute, it's... Um... Signs, isn't it? The white bits are the yeah, the one with the um, spaceship on it. Yeah, that's what that is. So I can just make out the spaceships around the edge. Okay, so we got this arch section followed by another big mouth. Yeah, those. One of those. That's what that's made of. That's what it looks like it's made of. Get down the other end here and have a quick peeky boos up here. Alright, so it's a kind of uh, big leafy structure in the middle. He certainly puts together a few fanciful ideas. Uh, we got some hide in the shade area. Obviously, because it's Hardly any night time, you've got to get out of the shade somewhere. Well, uh, what we got there? It's a big bollock with a microwave in the middle. <laughs> scientist bench. Uh, can you see through science bench? I never knew that before. Or is it an addition he's put on there? I have no idea. All right. So I won't guess. Up, oh, no, down a bit, up a bit, down a bit. 
big chair for snoozing in the midday sun, or in this case, all day sun. Small blue ball for telling your future. Uh, got some sort of trophy effect. Two gecks shouting in the middle there. And another pattern with the uh, living frigate type fish. And I forget what these stones are called, but anyway, those stones and a tree. <laughs> he certainly made some arrangements out of a lot of, lot of stuff I wouldn't even think of using. Um, this way to the toilets. Nope, don't be silly. Right. We've got a tree. I don't think there's a light in that one. I think it's lit by the actual fissure. Which, of course, not a good idea. Down we go. We'll come back on this side. Shall we look on the roof first? All right. Talk me into it. Up on the roof. Is a hole. I'm not falling in there. Well, I, I probably would if I didn't know what I was doing. Well, I don't know what I'm doing. I mean... If I didn't watch out for what I'm doing, is what I meant to say. Uh, let's get inside and have a look. A look. Uh, storm crystals. Ringer words. Uh, very large nip nips. Um, that's good. <laughs> collage at the back there. Interesting. And we got Pikachu with many eyes. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, seven eyeballs. And someone giving him the okay. That was great. I don't know if it's because he's taking a break from playing. Can I hear anything? Uh, only something in the background, but my volume's down low, so I can't hear anything here. Okay. And assembled bits with little, little botanical glass domes. Same on this side, but with chickens in them. And yet another Pikachu and hand. You gotta hand it to him. Ah, uh, these gecks are busts. Except if you can just start see the the bases down there, but it looks like just a bust. Um not sure what they these. They look kind of uh <laughs> it's like Advertising for safari. <laughs> Did we got those type of thing? Rhinoceroses? I don't know. I've never seen one. <laughs> ah. Hmm. And a mural. Mural. Yeah, stop waving. Um. We got the giant tripods, of course. I know they've only got two legs. The giant bipeds, if that's what I mean. Out we go. Down here is another entrance to of oh, the upstairs we've already been to. Okay, that's fine. We got a big white globe again. Not white globe. White walls. Get on top. Concrete roof. That water. And then we go up on top of the race initiator ceiling. And 
There's the shape of that. Ooh, shaped. <laughs> Hang on, I'm gonna fall off here and kill myself now. Hang on. Ouch. Okay, so past the pool. And interesting. Little yellow blobs on top of plants. So there's table oh yes, the tables. <laughs> tables. Okay, uh we got some sort of arranged item there. The rest of the roof. What's that? Swim under. So, I can't see it. Oh no, there it is. Swim under to use the big save. Underneath. What? Underneath here? Shit, that's big. <laughs> that is Ergum. Normanus. Let's see the save. Oh, wait, I just saw a save come up then. Oh, there's one. Let's save it. Ouch. There's a save. Here's the underside of the whole build. Um, hello? Hello? You left a bit. Uh, there's the batteries. Let's find out how much power is being used there. Oh, and the solar panels. Okay, batteries and solar panels and a wire hider. Battery. Hardly anything at all. That's not bad. 215 is hardly using anything. Right, let's get back up again. Right, we're back at the same point, so we go up over this Wednesday Bridge. Oh, I don't know where I am now. I see the bits and I jumped. So the Wednesday Bridge. Oh, it's moving around on its own. We go left. Up to a kind of garden on the top. An arrangement of uh, rocks, basically. <laughs> Hex plates and ossified stars. Interesting. What's that? I don't know what that is. No idea. There's another one. Why is it bright light? I don't know. I probably should know what that is, but I don't. So we just go down the other side. Bit of open air a bit. And another assemble of rocks. Hex plates. And uh, the cowshy shrooms and electric cubes. You can make an arrangement out of anything, this bloke. Very clever. I guess we're going this way. It's very steep. Whew. Can't see. It's so steep. What have we got up here? Well, we got the base computer. A kind of another rockery. Well. vegetable area and we've got a fish that's sitting on a chair he's obviously had enough of swimming just grab the coordinates here a second okay right carrying on what a carry on uh, should we get up on this roof yeah of course we will just have a look up oh, up 
I think I'm up. <laughs> I couldn't see my feet, but I thought I'm up. So there's the Wednesday Bridge. There's the other side. We were just dropped down in front of it because we've seen up there, so we can get down, basically. That's heated up vegetables. And a chair. You can sit there and look at the Wednesday Bridge. And the Diplo, the Diplo. Gek as usual. Uh, not Gek. Human. <laughs> They're like Gek, only got more letters in it. Um, we got another arrangement of vegetable matter here. Plants in the background over there. Big, really. Thing, plant, cut the pots, weed, and palm trees with their candelabra light. There you go, see? It's easy when you know how. Trouble is, I don't know how. Let's get over this bridge again because it's a bit steep. That one. There we go. This way. Kind of like another terraced. Design garden, basically. What's in there? I think it's just fish. You can see the fish there. I can't see a slug going around, so I think it's just a fish. More fish. And fish. The other end of the, what? What's that big ring? And it's just one of those um, tubes. Oh wait, it's um, there's a wavy bit there. Maybe it's a um, underwater door. Water, water door. Maybe. These are pinned upside down, obviously. That looks like three ships down there. Okay. It's very, very colourful. <laughs> uh, what have we got here? Kind of postural rockery. And uh, that seems to look like and with his head on upside down. Maybe a cow, I don't know. Not much difference between a cow and a cat. <laughs> Obviously not to me. Let's go back down again. Last piece of the Wednesday Bridge to get back down again. And it's very steep. It's actually made of... Um, that switches? No. Is it? Yeah, I think it is. It's made of switches, I think. What do I know? There's a message bowl, a message bowl, message thing. It's holding a ceiling up, obviously, because they can't float. We got there. Uh, same as we had on the other side, I think. With a big planet in the middle. All right, where we got the bogey people on fire? They have a cold, or they just live like that. Do we want to get on this roof? Or did we get on that roof? I don't think I did, but we will. Okay, well, we're up. 
again or not. I can't remember if I've done it already, so... If it's again, okay. Why is... nothing, okay. <laughs> we just zoomed our way through whatever that is. I have no idea, obviously. Oh, excuse me. I'm talking to a plant. A planet, I mean, not a plant. What we got over here? We got a rockery. He's like... He's like a kind of smiley critter. Yeah, I've already been there. And a big postal on the middle of his forehead. There's a couple of them here. Very, very... For him, effortlessly done. Oh, God, I'm stuck. Get out of the way. Turbium growth got in my ways. Let's get on a boat. Here's a boat. Get a mast. Small sails. But you can tell it's a boat. <laughs> I'm assuming it's a boat. Right, they've been shrunk, obviously. We got a, a water water thing on top of bricks food processor a chair everything you need for the office the torture device and there you have it biofuel obviously that's a biocontainment bowl followed by water now, are they suggesting what? Well, the taps are right on the front, so I guess it's just drinks. But by that sign, does that mean leaded and unleaded <laughs> for rocket fuel? And uh, don't drink too much of this, it puts your head in a spin. Let's go upstairs. That looks like you couldn't have. Almost like you can't fit underneath there. So up at the front of the ship. Get over here a minute. Here's the steering bit. Mind the wall. Who's he shouting at? Okay. Yeah. A pot. That's it's a kind of. Uh, Make it look a bit palm tree-ish, really. Okay, well, you know, this happens. It works. It works. Don't knock it. Can we? See, we can't get a lab bit. We can just about fit under the end over there, but not there, because that hurt my head. Out the door again. Onto the smaller boats. using big troughs to ferry people around. Oh, can't get out. <laughs> Great. Help, I'm stuck. Right. <laughs> Just so we don't have to jump through the awning. <laughs> and there it is. There's the other boat. You see the engine? Wait, is that an oil morning light? And he's shouting, turn left. I normally do. So there's that. This is the puddle called the pool. The floor's got holes in to let the water in. Uh, I don't know what they are. These rings. We get. We get up out of there, and jumped back over. Right, so that's the boat. So we were going this way. So we got another one of these. And I think it looks roughly exactly identical to the other one, except for it's on the other side. 
that makes any sense. No, okay. We got some art with bio, uh, the feeders. <laughs> you just, <laughs> hmm. It's supposed to be an animal, so it's head hanging off. It's got one on the other side as well. An artistic impersonation of an animal. That's what that is. So, I was just thinking that looks like a shutter. That looks like my ship up there, so we don't need to go that way. So this must be the last room. Shrooms. And skittles on the table, apparently. The Shouty Gek Barman. Oh, I got a red one. Is, is that normal colour red? Or is that caused by some light effect somewhere I can't see? Because that one's brighter. That must be a light. Uh, Turbium Grove with a pipe in the middle. So look at what else we got around here. We've got the seats, either TVs or microwaves. Make your own mind up, but don't watch the microwave if it's supposed to be a TV. What we got there? Oh, is that the same thing? Could be. Can't see the bubbles on that one though. And there is the last corner. It's a big flower. Right, okay. Out you go. Up to this empty flight deck. I left the empty flight deck to last. So we can have a quick look at the uh, flight deck again. As I said, there's six there. Which is really confusing. Hello, someone's humped my spaceship. Yeah, twits. Thank you. Right, well, we're off. We've seen it. It's great. I like the colours. Well done on the usage. Bits and pieces are great. We'll see you later. Ta-ra!